Uh, oh my goodness. Oh, that car. Okay, go. Oh, jeez. Oh, here we go. We released. Uh oh. Hello, coppers. Uh, there we go. Uh, you guys gonna follow me over here? Oh, that is so cool looking. So, folks, we're finally back with the ultimate showdown. So, last week we did Ram versus Ford, and folks, I had a lot of Chevy people that were very angry. So, folks, we've added some Chevrolets into the lineup here, and we are ready to run down the Crash Hard Mountain. Now, you're probably going to notice the one thing that sticks out like a sore thumb. Yes, that is an AMG 6x6, and I just wanted to throw it in there because it looks awesome. Also, that is a 2500 that has six wheels on it, and it has a muffler that that you could probably cram your whole head into. So we're ready to go. Comment down below. Are you Team Chevy, Team Ford, or Team Ram? And let's run some races. Okay, just because I'm biased and I really want to drive this 6x6, uh, we're going to start off here. So we are ready to go. Three, two, one, and we're off. And okay, the 6x6 doesn't get going as fast as I thought it would. But dude, that Ford Raptor took off on the inside. Okay, 6x6 is slowly gaining speed. Of course, like the Raptors, the TRX, uh, they're going to be really fast, but it's a question of can they make it down the Crash Hard Mountain in one piece? And folks, we are cruising right now. This thing is absolutely amazing. Uh, by the way, if you want to download any of the mods, I'll have them linked down in the description. Uh, oh my goodness. Oh, that car. Okay, go. Oh, jeez. All right, here we go. Over the jump with the 6x6. Oh, it lands perfect. Oh, I think we just ran over a Chevy. Uh, there is the TRX Mammoth. I don't know what was wrong with this engine. Holy man. Okay, we're not going to win, but man, this 6x6 might be one of the ultimate things to get down the Crash Hard Mountain in. The stability is absolutely incredible. Look behind us. All right, let's get a winner here. There is definitely one car. I'm going to say it was that Raptor. There was a like a trophy truck style Raptor that, oh my goodness, it took off. Like that thing was a beast. All right, so it is going to be Ford. Followed by the Ram here. Who do we have in third place? Close race here. Uh, it's going to be another Ram. And we do have a Chevrolet. Uh, look, Chevy did finish. And another Chevy. Okay, you know, even though the vehicles are wildly different that we spawned up there, there's no rhyme or reason uh, as far as, like, performance. We had a really diverse lineup actually finish this race. Hold on, what happened to the AMG? Oh my goodness, this isn't the AMG. This is, I think, a F-350 King Ranch. Or, I should say, it was an F-350 King Ranch. Oh, found the Mercedes. Um, in pretty rough shape. It didn't make it down to the jump. I say we run that again. Do you guys think we're going to get the same result? That Raptor is absolutely fast. All right, we're ready for another round here. Man, the Chevys were surprisingly uh, strong there. They pretty much all made it down except for one. It's this little booger right here. This Ford Raptor is incredible. And I was kind of feeling like maybe the uh, the TRX was going to give it a, a nice run for its money. I don't know what the heck's wrong with this. I think something happened to the model when I loaded it in. Uh, we got another TRX over here. Uh, they're going to have some issues. Uh, I don't know who's going to win. You know what? we got to switch manufacturers, though. I think I'm going to go ahead and pick a uh, Chevrolet here. I like this orange. And we are ready to go in the Chevy 3500. And we're off. And Okay, it doesn't have really good pickup initially. Look at all like the, uh, the powerful trucks weave in and out of traffic there. The TRX and the Raptor. Uh, okay, it's going to be a little tougher here. There goes the 6x6. That looks so cool. Like, this is the best thing ever. I love the uh, the trucks here in Beam and D Drive. All right, we're lagging a little behind. Something just flew off the right side of the mountain there. And oh, my goodness. I think it was one of the performance trucks. Wait, was it the Raptor? Uh, I don't... That might have been the Raptor. I'm not really sure. Holy man. Yo, the dually handled that like a champion. All right, race it down. There's something ahead of us. That could either be the Raptor. It might be a TRX. We might have to move the Raptor, folks, if that's it once again. So, wait for it. We're almost to the line. You know, we're not getting as many crashes. It's pretty remarkable how good these trucks are. All right, so we know Chevy finished second. Who was that in first? Was it the TRX or was it the Raptor once? He it is the Raptor. I think it was the TRX that flew off. So, we got Ford, Chevrolet. We got a really close finish here. And, oh, wait, what is this? Oh, it's the TRX. And there's a Chevy right behind it. That was close. Um, I mean, like, it doesn't really get much better than that, right? 
You had Ford, Chevy, and then Ram finished. Uh, also, the big heavy trucks, I think, are maybe having some issues here getting down the hill. Okay, what the heck happened? Um, did we get more death and destruction? Oh, my goodness. Uh, yes, we did. Oh, that's what we saw flying off the side of the mountain there. That's the, the TRX. And then I think the 6x6 Mercedes or the AMG crashed in the exact same spot that it did earlier. How did that even happen? Like, what are the odds? Okay, it is very clear to me that this Raptor has an insane amount of power. And you know what? We're going to have to do it. We're going to have to move it back a spot here. I'm going to stick the uh, Mammoth TRX in front of it. And let's see if it's still got that pickup and is able to get around its competition. By the way, you guys want to see something funny about the Mammoth uh, 1000 here? Watch this. Oh, <laughs> dude. It pulls so hard. I wonder if it's screwing up off the start because of how much air it gets. That's funny. Okay, I'm going to put my bias completely aside. Uh, I'm going to be the one manufacturer where it's like nobody really cares at the moment. Uh, everybody's here for the others. So I'm going to go down in the 6x6 uh, AMG. And yeah, let's see who's going to win. I'm curious if that Raptor is going to be able to overtake the uh, two in front of it and take home another victory. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. And we're off. Yo, the 6x6 gets going. What is wrong with that one ram? I think the one ram just broke down. I'm pretty sure there's some jokes that are going to be made there. And Oh, look, the Raptor is battling with the Chevrolet. Oh, are they going to turn each other? Oh, let's go. Boom. There we go. We moved it out. Oh, I took it out. Uh-oh, that was not good. Uh, does that mean the TRX now wins? Oh, the 6 by Oh, my goodness. The wheels just blew off this thing. Uh, oh, okay. This is why this thing can't make it down the hill. Okay, what do we have out in front? It is... We got a battle here. Oh, okay. There was a battle happening. Yeah, I think it's whatever performance truck you stick out on that left lane. Like, they've got it. Uh, even though I do think in a head... Wait, what the heck? Why is the engine about to fly out of this thing? Yeah, definitely something happened when I spawned this one in. Yeah, I think it just depends on who's got the favorite lane there. But as far as a heads up, I definitely think that Ford Raptor is a little faster. Uh, so yeah, looks like the Ram is going to win here. And hold on, what do we have in second? I think a Chevrolet's coming down. Yep, that's a couple Chevys, I believe. Look at that, two Chevys. Uh, wait, three Chevys, what the heck? The whole Chevy gang's here. That's one thing I've noticed about this. Uh, the Chevys, even though they don't take off as fast, they get down really nice. Like, that is three of them right there. Wait, was that the... Was that the ram that was broken down on the start and didn't go? I think it is. How did it just now get going? Uh, I am rather confused here. But, nonetheless, I'm having fun here. And I think that we should go to a bit of a different map and maybe test out some of these uh, newer models that I have. All right, so this looks like the perfect proving ground for some of these trucks. So, I am going to start off here with the Ram 6x6. Uh, I do have AI enabled. I don't know if this map actually supports it because they all seem to be... Oh, I think they're trying to turn around. Um, you know what? We don't even need them right now because we're going to go ahead and just try to go down this uh, this massive trail here. Oh, my goodness. All right. Let's see if this 6x6 can handle it. Oh, oh, that is cool. You know, the only thing I don't really like uh, these tires. Uh, the really, really low profile tires on trucks look weird to me. Uh, I prefer big meaty boys, but you know what? This is fine. We are bombing this trail in here. And oh, geez. Oh, slow it down. There's guardrails. Guardrails. <laughs> Could you imagine going down this road and this thing just flies across? Oh, the AI does work on here. <laughs> nice. Holy man, we're rolling a lot of coal here. All right, this is fine. All right, let's see if we can take off the cobs here. Uh, I feel like that might be a thing. And oh, man, the suspension, the roll on this, it works really well. Like, I'll give it that. Uh, back bumper's a little wobbly. Hello, coppers. Uh, there we go. Uh, you guys gonna follow me over here? Oh, that is so cool looking. All right, up the hill. Oh, jeez. Yeah, buddy. Uh, I don't think there's any way they can keep up with us. I say that, but I can see off in the distance, there are smoke trails or dust trails. They are trying to get to us right now, huh? And we can get over to the road here. Uh, boom. <laughs> I kind of busted out the windshield. That's fine. Don't need that anyways. Oh, uh, buddy. They are turning around on us here. Uh, something. I think I broke something in the left front. It is leaned over and it is pulling. It's actually pulling to the right. But if I leave the steering alone, it falls over. It's like I broke a shock or something. 
Yeah. Oh, geez. Uh, uh oh. Uh, we're starting to lose power here. I think I busted something else. Oh, wow. That cop almost hit us. Uh, okay, here we go. We got some more traction. Uh, yeah, we could do a lot of things that the cops can't do right now, especially in this 6x6. Six six. Like, this is a very, very capable off-roader. I love watching the uh, suspension work. This is awesome. All right, I see a guardrail up here. I am just... Okay, sub... Oh, we're dying out here. Are we overheating? There's no smoke coming out of it. Uh, I feel like something might have happened to this when we jumped it one too many times. Uh, this thing is perfectly capable of handling this desert, but I feel like another one here. We can't ignore what was dominating the competition. Let's go to this trophy truck version of the Raptor here. And I want to see what was... Oh, my. Yeah, I was trying to see what was going on with it. Yo! Okay. Uh, this thing is pretty sweet. Also, we do have to pull out a Chevrolet. Oh, I really want to jump this road. Uh, I know this is going to end so bad, but you know what? Uh, there we go! What the? Okay, land it! Land it! Don't roll! We lost a tire! You know, for the most part, we landed. Oh, never mind. Spoke too soon. I was going to say, for the most part, we actually landed that. Told you guys soon, I think we're going to have to do a, a hauling challenge. That way we can uh, give some of the other trucks some love. Say, like, the uh, the bigger, like, hauling trucks. Uh, dualies and stuff like that. Uh, so look out for that soon. If you guys have any ideas for that style of challenge, uh, comment down below. Dude, we are so fast. Like, this is sketchy, though. Oh, that is a guardrail. I guess we're going off this. Oh, my goodness. That was not a good idea. Yep. Oh, and we are going to roll here. Oh, wow. Maybe we should uh, find a truck that's going to stick the streets a little bit better. Uh, I shouldn't have the option to go off-roading because it always ends like this. All right, here we are in the 2500. I really do need to up my game in the Chevy category, though. I need to find a little bit faster ones. Uh, I'm pretty sure uh, there's some out there. Uh, but yeah, we're about to go over to the car jump arena. We're going to do another competition between the manufacturers. But we had to give the Chevrolet some love. This thing was really good on the Crash Hard Mountain. I must say, it was rather impressive. Oh, the cops are after us. Uh, this is like the perfect speed for me because I'm not dying. So that's... Oh, jeez, that's definitely a thing. Uh, here, let's go off-roading. There we go. Up the trail. Yeah, buddy. You guys going to turn off? I think they're going to start to turn off and try to follow us up here. Oh, let's just stick to this trail. Oh, yeah. Oh, I think we're actually going off the map here. Okay, that's where the map ends. Uh, that was... <laughs> I was like, man, the terrain looks a little bit different. Does that count as an escape for the Chevy? I want to say it does. Okay, so I have a nice glitch with my TRX that pops the engine out of it. Um, it doesn't always happen, but we have a showdown here. We have the Raptor, the TRX, and then I have basically my only Chevys are a 2500 and a 3500. But you never know. We're going to do a, uh, I guess, a distance competition here. Who do you think is going to make it the furthest? Obviously, you would think maybe go at speed, but you never know here. So let's line up. We're ready to go. Three, two, one, and we are off. All right, let's go down. See what kind of speed we can get here. Come on, buddy. You're going to need a little bit of assistance here. Uh, probably should have put some NOS in this bad boy. All right, let's see what we got here. I mean, it might land. It might actually skid quite far. Oh, geez. Dude, that was like the perfect launch. Okay, it's like... Or a little over 300 and wait what the truck held up i think that should count for style points there so we're looking at roughly like i want to say we'll give it maybe the uh, 350 mark but it made it and landed i don't know what is up with the balance on this truck but it's near perfect okay here we go with the uh the ford raptor here we're ready three two one and we're off of course this thing's gonna have more speed uh oh geez so, question is, I think it's going to go further, but how's it going to hold up when it lands? You know, this is going to be surprising if it doesn't go as far. Oh, here we go. We released. Uh-oh. You know, it didn't go that much further. And oh, it landed on its back. Um, I don't think we're driving away from that. Oh, end over end. Uh, oh, it's going to go a little further. I think the Chevy was stopped by the, uh, by the tower there. That wasn't as smooth of a jump as the Chevy. It didn't make it that much further. All right, we're ready. Three, two, one, go. Yeah, buddy. Oh, geez. All right, here we go down. Uh, I wonder how this thing's geared out. Uh, here we go. Wait, what the heck? Uh, that's not right. Why am I talking about like 140? 
Uh, it's not a thing, and uh-oh! Wait, the shallow jump didn't go as far, but it landed. Yeah, I think there's something wrong with the gearing on this thing. Uh, I have to look at it. Is it the whole fact that the engine's basically hanging out? Not sure we're gonna get a definitive result there. I might have to look around and see what's wrong with this particular mod. I don't like it like the other trucks that I put in there, but I must say as far as the most impressive truck on the jump, the Chevy actually wins it for me there. That was such a nice landing that, uh, yeah, that was uh, beautiful.